Today, I want you to declutter all of the junk in your head. Now, we're not going to accomplish all of that today. <laughs> That's probably going to take a lifetime, right? But let's declutter all of the fear of failure. This has been coming up a lot around me, so I felt like it's something I need to talk about. Um, I feel like everyone's talking about failure. Everyone's talking about their fear of failure. And a lot of people are staying stuck because of the fear fear of failure. I have been through this many, many times. I deal with it all the time and I'm sure it will always come up. But the difference is I have found ways to push through it and show up. I don't show up perfectly, not even close. It's really easy to look at people who are further along in their journey and compare yourself, but that's not going to help anything. I love looking at people who are where I want to be. I surround myself with people like that because I want to learn from them and I want to associate myself with people who have had success and learn from them because that's how you're going to get to that next level. But I can't compare myself to them. So my chapter 10 is nowhere near their chapter 100, but they've had a chapter 10. They've had all of those chapters along the way. It's easy to get stuck looking at them and thinking, oh, they just have it easy. They've been so successful. But if you ask them, 100% guarantee they will have a long list of failures. They will have a long history of showing up imperfectly and they'll be proud of it. When you talk to someone who is successful and who has gone through this, they'll be proud of their failures. They might not have been back when they were where you're at now, but they are now because they've gotten through it, they've been resilient, and they've moved forward. So my challenge for you today is to start to, de to declutter all of that junk in your head that's keeping you stuck, that's keeping you living in fear, and making you not move forward. So pick one thing today that you're scared of and conquer it or at least start the process of conquering it. Let's get rid of all that junk in your head, all of the things that are keeping you plain small. And I'm doing this along with you. I've conquered a lot already, but I have a whole lot more to conquer. I don't think you ever get to a point where you stop because if you do stop, then you're not actually moving towards anything. If everything feels good and comfortable, you're not really moving anywhere. You're where you're at, stuck where you're at. And maybe you want to be stuck where you're at. There are people who are happy where they're at and that's great. But if you have that desire to move forward in your life, in your business, with your passions, whatever it might be, you're always going to be reaching for the next step. So you're always going to have a level of discomfort. It's just learning how to get through that discomfort and know it's there, recognize it, appreciate it and move on and move through it. As long as you're moving through it and moving along, you're in the right place. You just don't want to stay stuck for too long. We all have the days where we want to give up. We all have the days where, you know, we feel bad for ourselves and don't feel like we can move forward. That's okay. Take that day or a chunk, a little period of time, take a couple hours to step away from the situation, feed your soul, and then get back at it. Show up. Even if it's imperfectly, you're never going to please everyone. You're not going to please yourself all the time. But what makes people successful is constantly showing up, doing their best to have laser focus and moving forward. So I would love to hear what you are going to focus on decluttering from your brain. So let me know. Uh, come find me on Instagram at the Amanda Davila and let me know, send me a DM or post it in your stories. What's it going to hurt? Post it in your stories and tag me. I'll feature you on my page. That's going to get your name out even more to another audience. You've got this and you have a community who supports you and will help move your business forward.